My office is filled with books. I mean, it's just full of books all over this room. I could uh, invite you to come in and sit here and have a conversation with me and we could talk about the books. But what do, what do all the books have in common? There's a variety of um, styles of writing uh, and through many uh, seasons of life, uh, throughout many centuries, these books have been written. Um, and I love them. They, the books have affected me in a variety of different ways. Um, but what do they all have in common? Other people. Um, books that recently were released or books that were written long ago, they all have in common people. Um, studying, doing research, uh, reading, reading well, uh, reading books. These are ways of inviting people into our lives. Um, I like being outside in nature and spending time alone, but I love also to be with with people, to have other people in my life. And, and I want you to do that also. Let's not live life alone. Uh, let's find the equilibrium where we can engage in dialogue with people who are sitting right here at a table beside us or sitting in an office like this with us, having deep conversations or just fun dialogue and laughing together, eating together, having meals together, watching a ball game together, just enjoying moments together. Um, but yeah, also inviting people throughout history so that we can study from their thoughts and their thinking. Uh, choose to invite other people into your life. Maybe you've been hurt by people and you would rather be alone. Don't let that control you. Uh, invite people to be a part of your story.